The left stick controls your player movement. The right stick controls your camera. People you can interact with have icons above their heads. Press the X button to talk with them. Finally, I was beginning to think you forgot what today was. Of course, I was first in line. Oh, before I forget, I think Rasky is just ahead. He wanted to thank you for helping him cram for the astrometrics final. There you are. I wanted to thank you for helping me pass that final, and for all the other times you've helped me. I've always admired you. I hope Starfleet recognizes all you've done to lead our class. What ship did you get? Good luck. Before you report to Lieutenant Farron and get your assignment, you should find Tavral. She wanted to talk to you. She's just up the pathway. Greetings. It was good of you to encourage me to retake the linguistics final. I was willing to accept my original results, but you saw that I was not at my best that day. My score increased by 12.8% on the second attempt, well within my standard norms. Now I am qualified to serve as both a science officer and a communications officer. Morik would like to see you as well. He is ahead of us on the path. Live long and prosper. Your minimap shows you where your objectives are. An arrow will appear on the minimap if you are far away from your objective. There you are. Getting excited yet? Once we finish our training cruise, we'll all be full-fledged ensigns. The buzz is, Captain Taggart hasn't named all of his senior staff yet. From what I heard, the advanced phaser training simulation is tripping people up. Good afternoon, cadet. What can I do for you? Yes, I have the complete assignment list here. Name? Let's see. Interesting. Report to Captain Taggart. He's in the office behind me. You're going to have to ask him. Objects you can interact with have a glow around them. Press the X button to interact with the doorbell to notify Captain Taggart of your presence. Come. Cadet. I did. I've been following your progress here at the Academy, and I must say, I'm impressed. I'm just looking at your final test scores, but I don't see your results for the advanced phaser training program. I want everyone on my senior staff to run that program. I want to see good results, no exceptions. I did. Like I said, I've been following your career here at the Academy. If you complete that program, I can put you on my bridge. I'll ask my tactical officer to set it up. Another fine cadet like yourself. Her scores were almost as good as yours, but her record has a few blemishes. Still, I'm sure Cadet Flores will settle down and become a fine officer someday. 
I'll tell Flores to meet you out in the quad. Talk to her to start the phaser training, and I'll see you when you're finished. You're dismissed, cadet. I got the tactical officer spot, just what I wanted. Where'd you end up? You never did that? I thought you were Mr. Extra Credit. Everyone knows that Captain Taggart expects all his top people to pass that program. Don't worry, you'll do fine. Come on, I'll take you to the holodeck and set it up. Seems most of our class ended up on Captain Taggart's ship. Have you seen the whales in San Francisco Bay? I never seem to spot them. I sometimes forget that Boothby is a hologram. He seems like such a fixture here at Starfleet Academy. To sprint, press and hold the left stick Last while one moving. of the console buys the first round tonight! Setting up the training program now. I hope Holodeck 2 is your lucky Holodeck. Shoot stuff, don't die. Pretty basic, really. Phasers are in the lockers by the Holodecks. You can grab one there. Press left to scan the area. Your tricorder will point you toward your nearest objective. Satisfactory. Absolutely. I have a new first officer. Congratulations. Yes. You should be proud of your accomplishments here, Cadet. You have a promising career ahead of you in Starfleet. First officer, way to go. Just a little jealous, I'll admit. <laughs> At least now you'll get to boss us all around like you've always wanted. You'll do great, but we should head up to the shuttle bay. Everyone else is waiting there for the ceremonial send-off toast. First officer, way to go! Just... Yes, sir. Right away, sir. May I get you a rack to Gino, sir? You'll do great. But we should head up to the shuttle bay. Everyone else is waiting there for the ceremonial send-off toast.
Okay, all of the senior staff is waiting by the bar. I'm sure everyone's a bit nervous, this being our first real assignment, y'all. So, I'm expecting an inspiring speech out of you. Something heartwarming. Make Tavrell cry. This mission could just determine the rest of our careers. No pressure. I'll meet you over there. We're finally doing this. Oh, look at that. The USS Vesta, first of her class. She's got subsystem targeting, a crew of 750, auxiliary phaser cannons, and even a quantum field focus controller. I can't wait to captain one someday. But here's our ship. Miranda class, 200 crew, two forward weapon mounts, one aft. Average speed, warp 5 point nothing. She's a tough little ship though. I think I like her. We're the final shuttle to arrive. We need to get to the bridge. check in and then head for the bridge. See you there. Name and position? I have your record right here, sir. Welcome to the ship. Captain Taggart is waiting for you on the bridge. Use the turbo lift behind me. It will take you directly there. number one. Early in my career, I served with a captain who called his first officer that. I always liked it. As my number one, I expect you to ensure my orders are carried out, and 
So advise me on the best course of action in any situation. But first, we need to get out of dry dock. Get clearance from control and close the shuttle bay doors. Then disable the tractor moorings. Earth traffic control has cleared us to depart, sir. Very good, number one. Shuttle bay doors are closed, sir. Very good, number one. Take us out. One quarter impulse. Just checking to see if you were paying attention, number one. Potter, take us out. Maximum thrusters. To sit, press the X button while targeting the chair you wish to sit in. From dry dock, Captain. Good. Let's start with something easy. Set course for Vulcan. Course lead in, sir. Engage. Captain. I am picking up a distress call from the SS Breakeven. Audio only. Let's hear it, Tavrell. This is the SS Breakeven. Our warp core is failing, and we are in need of assistance. Let them know we're on our way. Potter, lay in a rendezvous course. Altering course, sir. ETA three minutes. Transporter room, prepare to beam over survivors. Sir, sensors can't read anything in the vicinity of the Breakeven. Communications are out as well. Keep trying to help them, Tavrell. Number one, let's discuss the situation. You heard the distress call, number one. What do you think we should do? Absolutely not. We're the closest ship to the break-even, so it's our duty to assist. Good. What do you advise? We don't have that kind of time, number one. I agree. Flores, raise shields. Number one, get down to the transporter room. You'll oversee the rescue effort from there. Getting some weird readings. Uh, I can't get a solid lock. There may be interference. Trying to compensate. I think I have it. This is a lot different than the training scenarios. Beaming them over now. Hang on! This vessel is now property of Captain Kadak of the IKS Chart.
Klingon transporter signatures are showing up all over the ship. You have the command codes to unlock an armory near your position. Arm yourself, and any security team members you find. We still have weapons, I'll do what I can. For now, I need you to concentrate on getting those Klingons off my ship. Tag it out.
up here and the Klingons could send a boarding party at any time. I need you back on the bridge. Go see to the bridge. We will secure this area. Incoming transmission from the Klingons. This is Captain Kayak of the IKS Chant. You may have forced my boarding parties off your decks, but our ship remains cluffed. You have no hope of fighting us or defeating us. Your choice is simple. Surrender, or we will kill your captain and then destroy your ship. Perhaps your captain will change your Mind. Order your crew to surrender, Captain, or I will blow them out of the sky! It's your choice, Captain. Do you want these children to die? Very well. Number one. You are now the captain of the ship. Your orders. Target lock, Captain. Signal. What now? We... We survived. But the captain... Captain Tiger knew what happened. And he gave the order anyway. Ultimate sacrifice. One that we all might... He trusted you to take command. All we can do now is survive. And remember him.
All decks reporting in, sir. We took some casualties, and sick bay is full. All ship systems have taken some damage, but some are worse than others. Life support is stable, but anything else could be an issue. I have been trying to get a distress call out, Captain, but something is jamming all frequencies. She's still cloaked, but I think she took some real damage. We're in rough shape too, Captain. Still running diagnostics, sir. Took us some time to get the systems back online. Hailing the break even now, Captain. Oh, um, hello, Starfleet. No hard feelings, right? I had to send that distress signal. If I didn't, that crazy Klingon was going to blow my ship into space junk. And, um, because Starfleet's always ready to help and all, uh, could you help me repair my ship? Uh, I, I'm grateful for all you've done to save my ship and cargo already. But the sooner I can get out of here, the sooner I'll be safe from Kaden. Press up to increase your ship's speed. Press down to decrease your ship speed. Use the left stick to pitch downward or upward, as well as to turn left or right. Helm, full stop. I've stopped us this time, sir, but from now on, you'll be responsible for adjusting the speed of the ship. Looks like she just needs three or four warp induction coils. We have plenty of those to spare. Position yourself near the ships and press the X button to interact with them. Thanks! We'd help you if we could, but I just don't see any profit in that, you know? Well, looks like we're on our own. At least they said thank you, I guess. About that cloaked ship full of Klingons? Almost done, Captain. Level 2 diagnostics shows that almost all of the plasma injectors are damaged beyond repair. Not enough. Plasma injectors are made to withstand quite a beating, but I think the Klingons specifically sabotaged them when they boarded us. It's an easy way to cripple the ship. I'm installing what spares we have, but we're short three injectors. Without them, we can't go to war. We're not the first ship the Klingons have hit here. There's wreckage all over this region. I can scan the derelicts and see if any of them have intact plasma injectors. Bingo! I found some suitable debris in the boneyard nearby. Destroy three of those nacelles, and we should get the parts we need. Press the R2 button to fire an energy weapon. An item has dropped for you. Move towards the item to automatically loot it. Taking through scraps we've left behind. Yeah, that guy's getting annoying. Plasma injectors will do the trick, sir. Gorgeous technology. Type R, if I had to guess. 3.7 liter flow cooked with shielded reservoirs and a drop flow induction coil. 